The anti-hijab resistance is not just raging in Iran, but it has now gone fully global. Different human rights organizations have been reporting on the deaths by the crackdown of security forces in the country. Yet it remains equally violent and women and even men in Iran continue to protest against the strict moral policing of hijab. Here's a report. 16-year-old Nika Shakarami burnt her hijab during a protest standing on a metal box. Hours later, she became the latest martyr of the anti-hijab protests in Iran. When I was on the phone with Nika, I could hear her and her friends shouting and talking about security agents as if they were running away. Nika's phone was switched off right then. My daughter was killed the same day she went missing in the protests. Her body was handed to morgue on the same day. Coroner's office letter read that she was killed on the same day because of numerous blows to the head by a hard object. There was nothing else. I saw the body myself. But the Iranian regime claimed that Nika fell to her death from a high building while protesting. She is not alone. Another 16-year-old, Sarina Esmal Zadeh, was killed on 23rd September in Karaj by beaten blows of the security forces during an anti-hijab protest. 23-year-old Hadith Najafi was shot multiple times during demonstrations sparked by the death of young Masa Amini on 16th September. The 22-year-old was beaten and detained by the moral police and she died in custody. But the government of Iran claimed with a medical report that she died of prior cardiac disease, a claim that has been refuted by Masa's family. Masa's death became a spark for this protest movement across Iran and Kurdistan. Iran is burning with anti-hijab protests. The crackdown on protesters has been strict and violent. Human rights groups estimate dozens of protesters have been killed over the past four weeks. On 6th October, Amnesty International accused the Iranian security forces of having killed at least 66 people, including children and wounding hundreds after they fired live round at the protesters and bystanders. Iranian state television suggested at least 41 people had been killed in the demonstrations as of 24th September alone. Whereas, an Oslo-based group called the Iran Human Rights on 8th October reported at least 185 people, including at least 19 children, have been killed in the nationwide protest across Iran. Iranians living abroad have joined the protest through social media. The latest viral video is that of actor Elnaz Norozi. This Iranian living in India has put out a video saying, My body, my choice. Elnaz strips on social media to protest against the hijab. She clarified her protest by saying, She's not promoting nudity, but her protest is in favor of promoting freedom of choice. Bureau Report, India Today.